No, I, I think all of those vorches were just tourists. Yep, just tourists. So, that was the biggest firefight we've had yet by fair margin. It's not bad. It's more fun to play than it is to watch, that's for sure. Especially when you're trying to think of something to say, and there's just nothing to say. Like, okay, I'm shooting people, I'm running out of ammo. What else do I say? I don't know. Maybe Anyways. it's time to quick save, so I'm gonna have to do that again. Yeah, quick save. Um, oh, clinic, we're there already. That wasn't bad. Oh, what's this Oxera thing on the signs? What? A lot of signs say Oxera around here. Do they ever tell you what that is, or is it I just, don't know. It's probably just you know, like a company or something. Background that I obviously not paying any attention to. No funny business once you're in the clinic, unless you want to deal with those max. There's only two. You know how many of those I could kill? I'm sure yeah, there's more well, somewhere. Done. That's all of them. I just I just cleaned up like two big squads of guys, so. Morden's around here somewhere. Uh, go talk to him. We need all the help we can get. Well, I'm sure Morden's got more than them around. Yep. Morden saved my life. I owe him everything. Professor, we're running See, there's more. Use Melanorin. Plenty on hand. Almost as good. Causes cramping in Batarians. Supplement with Butemerol. Causes cramping in Batarians. <laughs> That's fine. Bonds to genetic markers. Hard to find. Expensive to mass produce. Why not Heplicor? Too unstable. Inconsistent. <laughs> I'm just listening to Morden. Okay. Here we go. Everyone loves Techno Professor Morden Solis. Yep. He is, he is so much Techno Battle. Hmm. Don't recognize you from area. Too well armed to be refugees. And no the stilted dialogue. Quarantine still in the back. Very for something else. Jagged. Crew to clean them out. No, no actually, like symptom, not a con. um, Solarian. Okay. Investigating possible use of bioweapon. No, no, no. Too many guns. Shush. Love yeah. of God, pick up red. <laughs> I came here to find you. Okay. Most Solarians don't really talk shot. that way, but he definitely I'm on a does. Mission, <laughs> and I need oh, your love help. of God, take up mission? red. What mission? Yeah. No, 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 no. I, 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 I'm confused. Plague spreading too fast. Who sent you? This is interesting. Covert and privately funded human group. Related to plague. Doesn't affect humans. Human centric interest. Few human groups would know me. Privately funded. What is that supposed to mean? Not alliance standard. It's not not government funded. Too unstable. Only one option. I love how he figures it out. Unexpected. Cerberus might not have the best Yeah, well, but we need your help. They're not exactly the most covert of covert agencies. Nope, no they are not. The collectors are kidnapping entire human populations. We're gonna find out why. So I just have them. to follow the main plot, even Collector. though it doesn't actually matter Plague compared to the actual main plot of the Collectors entire series. Of groups with technology to design. Which is Uncle shooting mercenaries. But must stop yeah, the, the, first. totally. That's what we're Need supposed to, to do. At environmental control center, Vorcha guarding it. Need to kill them. Just Nothing once, reasonable. I'd like to ask <laughs> someone for help and hear them say, "Sure, let's go right now. No strings attached." Well, you did just hire the negotiation. We all want. We all give. You're in the middle of a practical war zone with pl with a plague running rampant, and you're expecting the doctor to just leave. I think to it makes everyone. sense that he's staying. Need to get power back on before district suffocates. Here, take plague cure. Also, bonus in good faith. Weapon from dead blue sun's marks may come. Well, I mean, it would be Borcha. nice if there were a way to do this that didn't involve gunning down a couple dozen mercenaries, but hasn't come back. whatever. The doctor doesn't yeah. have much chance against a I was playing. Uh, I, uh, I just started Deus Ex, and um, Stubborn. it actually gives go. you the exact dialogue you're gonna say, which is kind of nice. Careful, bright future. I hope. Okay, I'm just ignoring all the extras, Let's head for the environment even though plan. it is more than. But whatever. Carnifex. Yes. yes. Good. Restore power. Release. Well, I mean, I've kind of. Well, let's see. I I haven't played it in a while. Does it show you the entire dialogue or just the first sentence? Usually, most of it. Sometimes it's. Not quite all of it, but definitely what what's in the choice is definitely a part of what he says. Some fairly often, it's exactly what. It yeah, says. I mean, I don't remember it being quite that perfect, but certainly there was better than a this. lot less. Pick the option, and Shepard says something completely different. Yeah, Carnifex. So the Carnifex is Pan Cannon. Awesome. Nice yeah. name. And it it deserves that name because it's awesome. Um, it does a lot more damage per shot than the Predator, and obviously has a smaller clip. On our way here, we saw demons looting the apartments of the dead. Make me sick. I actually like most of the Batarians. So, let's see. Where's the Carnifex? So, like, yeah, only... The random signs seem to be... Oh, you've walked away from them. Yeah, I'm not paying attention. Next time we see a sign, it's gonna say, Warning, not much air left, or something like that. 
Yeah. I'm not sure why the signs are connected to the environmental system, but whatever. Yeah. Okay. <coughs> ah. Okay, let's just just ambush these guys. See if this works. Probably not. Wow, he's not dying. That works perfectly well. He's just not dying. But I like this gun so much more. Yep, he's not dead yet. That's a, that's an advantage. That is surprising. So much shooting. Merciless. I am. I wish the enemies were as as friendly about dancing around in the middle of the game. Well, apparently they are, because he died. Well, so though, they're at least staying on their line. Yeah. Why am I not healed yet? It's taking a long time. There we go. Oh, Krogan. Down, down, down. I like the Carnifex because it's like a mini sniper rifle, except it's more ammo. So it works better. Yeah, that happens in other games. Yeah. Do you have the original Deus Ex or just Human Revolution? I, I only have Human Revolution right now, but I'm planning on getting Deus Ex. Yeah, because the original Deus Ex had that pretty bad. The pistol fully upgraded would just be so good. Yeah. So that wasn't hard. Oh, wow, there's another one. Fairly, it wasn't as bad as the last one, especially when I don't die in the middle. But there's more, so yeah. But wait, there's more. Yep. Just hours of shooting people. I, Mass Effect One seemed pretty split, seemed split almost evenly, but there's a lot more shooting in this one. More of there's more shooting as filler in this. Yeah, and so there's not actually something. Not and this. there's not actually something going on in Aspect One. But at least I'm just mowing through them pretty easily right now. No, not the grenade launcher. Keep accidentally switching to the grenade launcher <laughs> instead of the sniper rifle. Is there a way to take guns out of your menu that you don't actually use? No. Well, you don't, there's not that many guns in this game, so it's not that hard. But you can never get more than like five down here, so it's not that big a problem. You coward! Right. Yeah. There's technically five different kinds. But the SMG basically has the same role as the assault rifle, which I don't have. So, um, soldiers don't get that one. This SMG does no damage. Well, he's dead. Almost done. And there we go. That fight scene's over with. For now. Hurrah! Yep. I do. Okay, I do give enjoy. Okay, seconds. There'll be more. Yeah. I do enjoy the fighting most of the time, and it's the cover system definitely works better than Mass Effect One, and then things die slightly more realistically than Mass Effect One, and the different ammo types is nice. Okay, now where were we after that unfortunate crash? Double. Going this way. Yeah, double crash. It crashed again. The crash crashed, and that shift button is not helping me at all. It's supposed to tell me where to go, but it's not. Have I been up here? Let's see. Oh, an unhacked bank terminal. A sign that I have not been here before. If Shepard hasn't looted it, he probably hasn't seen it. Yep, exactly. At least it's easy. Look at that. <laughs> so much time left. Anything interesting? No, no, no. Everything's so red. I guess it's emergency lighting, but it's a plague. It's not. Well, I, I believe the deal is the Vortex killed the ventilation system. Oh. That still isn't a good reason for mood lighting, but. Yeah. So here's the assistant that Morton was talking about. 
to believe me. Perhaps they're preparing for, I don't know, disco championship? That would explain your <laughs> likes. One more step and kill your friend. Pull that trigger and you're breathing through a new hole in your head. Let him go when you walk away. Oh, God. He's... I must think the is stupid. What's to stop you from killing us if we let him go? Let him live, I let you leave. Kill him, I do the same to you. You at least have a chance of surviving if you stop. Yeah, I'm Let surprised the Shepard didn't just say that instead of reiterating the thing of the Batarians already. No, this is, this is funny. I can say you can go, or no, I can't trust you. So you can just immediately turn back on your word and say, I'm not, I'm going to kill you. I'm going to let him go. We had a deal. Yeah, you don't get renegade for that, I think. You probably would, but... He wasn't red. You don't well, usually... you only get red on the ones on the left side. They're, they're, uh... Um, their con their uh, diplomacy, convincing, intimidate, that kind of thing. You get you get points for pretty much everything. It's too dangerous out here. Like you can just randomly be talking to someone, and you'll get like two renegade points if you pick the bottom one. I'll go right away. Yeah, with that said, thanks again. This is another one of the things where backstabbing the Batarians doesn't really seem like a renegade thing, in so much as it is a jerk thing. Well, you know, once he's gone, yeah, there's no reason to kill him. Unless you want revenge. Well, they might go do something similar to someone else, so you could argue that. It's not quite as jerky as a lot of the other things you you can do. If you were killing them for that reason, then that would be... Well, except you're still killing people. Paragon is fine with that. Yeah. But they aren't actively doing anything. It's just killing someone in cold blood. But, it's it's arguable. And I get the Carnifex, and all of a sudden, I am not using my sniper rifle ever, because the Carnifex is amazing. Looks like we've got another shooting gallery level. Yeah, but they're dead. I just love it when they've got these lines. It's just this massive chest eye wall, waist yeah. eye wall. So I think we're, we're bored of setting up chest eye walls. So we just put in one and called it a day. <laughs> yeah. This part is annoying as heck. Good thing I have a sniper rifle. Oh great, the place with the rocket launcher. Yep. More more than one of them, actually. Now, splash damage should be killing you, but... Yeah, <laughs> that one went right over my shoulder. This is entertaining. I'm He's more concerned about the ones that splat on the wall right behind you. Splash damage should, you know... Yeah. Be able to get the head, which is kind of beefy over the Of course it is. So that was not nearly as difficult as it has been usually. We've got two down already. And there's two more. Oh, I ate at least one there. Hey, Jacob did something useful. What squad is this? Boom squad is what that says. Boom squad. That's such a stupid name, isn't it? Oh look, more dudes down there. I guess the Vorta did their own name. <laughs> Didn't realize that they were literate, so I guess it is a step up. They're not that dumb. Quite. And you can curve powers in this game. So you can like hit people more easily, so that's nice. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, I don't know, I mean... The Vorta... I get that there's a universal translator sort of thing, but still, if they're speaking in broken English, they... Yeah. <laughs> At least know, the Krogan are literate. Programmed the translator was just racist. <laughs> that would be funny. So the Vorsher are annoying because they regenerate even faster than the Krogan do. Well, they're also annoying because they shoot fire at you. Yeah. But luckily they're way too far, way too far away. But yeah, Vorcha Pyros are a pain. Hey, he's, a, he's actually kind of close. Oh, I can't shoot him. Come on. Come on. Oh, that was a pretty decent shot. So Mass Effect 2 actually has headshot damage, which Mass Effect 1 did not. So that's nice. And it's very satisfying sometimes. You hit them and they blow up. <laughs> <laughs> Exploding head syndrome. 
Yep, exactly. Carnifex for the win. I'm out of sniper rifle ammo. Or I was. Where are they? They're there. Jacob! Oh, where are you? I don't care. It just makes it really annoying that you have to actually pay attention to your ammo in this game. So you have to actually look around and pick up the ammo. Which is just irritating. Wait, this is respawning. I just picked this up. And I love how ventilation controls this huge building with these giant signs instead of yeah. you know, a closet like it would actually be. Yeah. And you should see the room that we go in. I yeah. swear these were respawning. That's strange. I know it's, it's a giant room with, you know, high ceilings and pillars. In we go. Oh, it's an entire building. Pretty much. Ah, I forgot about the hallways. Yep, hallways. Although, in retrospect, I guess hallways really shouldn't have surprised me. Yeah. Slightest. Yay, achievement. I already got a headshot achievement. No. Oh look, another shooting gallery. Can I go over this one? Pretty soon now there's going to be a really annoying part. Where there's just pyros and you have to go around the corner and hit them. To like really get to them. Compared to the rest of this yeah, like it's actually hard. Annoying. Ouch. Oh, he said hit the fan. <laughs> See, this is the room I was thinking of. Yeah, this is the main room. It is so ridiculous for a mechanical room. Yeah. I've had enough of it. It's just huge. It would be nice if it were, you know, some kind of ventilation cargo cult. You know, this is the temple of Ventilatron. <laughs> but no, it's just a giant room for a bunch of fans. A lot of fans. Like, there's one over there, there's more over there. Th this fight's going to take a while. So I might as well get comfortable. I mean, if it were filled with fans, it might make a little bit of sense, but it's mostly just... Yeah. Uh, there are fans. Look, Pyro. Good shot. Thank you, Jacob. Up? It's just you're looking across a football field-sized room, go. and there are no fans. <laughs> Not very many, anyway. I guess is that in the back is it an a fan? Yeah, that, that's a fan. That's a fan. It's not on. It's not, but that's the problem, that's why we're here. Yeah, yeah, it is a fan. And there's like more on the sides over there, but there's actually more rooms to go into, see? Still though, you shouldn't be able to look across a football field swath of room and see only one fan. Yeah. In a room that is supposed to be for ventilation. I suppose it's a airborne cure, which is kind of unusual. Because you have to turn the fans in to distribute the cure. Cure the put the fans on. And so many Vorcha. Fans, you can't just, you know, run around with a mister. Ow, ow, ow. Rockets. <laughs> Elmo time. <laughs> yep. So many rockets. And this is on this is on one of the harder difficulties, and I'm still just eating rockets. Yeah, well, you've got your chest high wall. I'm sure you'll be fine. Yep. That one just hit you. <laughs> yeah, they actually hit you and you still survive. <laughs> oh, I saw him fall. That was fun. He seems to be clipping through the railing. Was he? It's possible. I ran out of ran out of sniper rifle ammo again. You don't say. Yep. It happens all the time. Oh. More Vorcha. Of course. So many of them. Ha ha ha! Did you see that? Not yet. You will soon. He exploded and killed like the entire group. It was amazing. You know, you think if they really wanted to take the fans out flying, they would just shoot holes in them. Yeah. Instead of you know actually bothering to turn them off. Exploding, exploding Fortra are fun. Why 
aren't they just turning the light off? More Vorcha. God dang. And for that matter, all you did was flip a switch. Why do you have to go in there to flip a switch? Yeah, why isn't the switch at the main control board? With everything else. I mean, I'm sure this would be really useful for engineers, you know. Oh, I'm running the fans? Want to turn some off? Okay, time for a jog. Yeah. This is almost as bad as Cerberus storing their secure logs in computers in the open all over the ship. Yeah, all over the ship. Or base, or whatever it was. I'm going to randomly What's have my... What's a mission report? Well, he's going to have to run for it. Oh, it's a Krogan. Hello, Krogan. He doesn't look like he's wearing armor. That doesn't look like armor. And the result of turning the fans on, on is way. lots of particle effects. Yeah. Yay, particle effects. Oh. Oh, there's no roll in this game. Oops. Crap. Oh, no. <laughs> How far back did I go? I hope you quick saved. I probably quick saved after I turned it on. I probably auto saved after I turned on the fan. Yeah. Which it wasn't that I long ago. I tried to do a roll up from Mass Effect 3 and it didn't work. <laughs> uh, I can't tell. Where, where am I? Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Uh, all the way back here. That's that's annoying. See, this is what happens when you have bad auto save. Is the auto save less less active? It should be on. Because I know it didn't put me back this far when I... This is kind of ridiculous. Stupid pyro! And that rocket almost murdered me. And actually would have killed Slams me since I had no hope. Yep. Let's see. Here goes. I'm having fun shooting things though. At least, at least that's good. One they heal so dang fast. Yeah, since we talked to Morden, pretty much. Well, let's see. I mean, even then, Morden didn't really do anything that yeah. interesting aside from be Morden, which admittedly yeah. is pretty nice. Yeah. Did you? Don't forget to flip the switch in the back of the room. Well, I don't actually have to flip that switch yet. That that switch is for the uh, act to turn the cure on after you turn on the fans. I thought you were supposed to hit that one first. What I'm not. Uh, we'll see. See if that door's locked. It's locked. You're right. Of course, there's no particular reason for the door to be locked. But no, no, not at all. And how can you get a cure into fans using a switch anyways? That's a good you point. should be spraying or some such. Especially holographic switches. Door's locked in. Once we get the fans yeah, you know, there, there is nothing here that looks like a port for cure. Nope, just, just holograms. You should be, you know, tossing a spray bottle into a vent. Or <laughs> That'd be funny. That would still be goofy, but it would at least... Make makes slightly slight more sense. Of sense. There we go. Located the fan controls. No, not the grenade. Uh, grenade oh, launcher. No. So now it's time to snipe some more rocket launcher dudes. Yeah, Edie, you're an AI. Why can't you just hack the friggin' fan controls? Which she does similar things later. Quick save. Miss out on our cover base shooting. Yep. Can't can't quick save. It won't let me. Uh, see if you can in the fan room. Once you've I will. Off. Yeah. Oh, he's so close. Okay, he's dead now. Enemy down. We already went through all this. I'm so bored. I may edit out. The First try since I'm an idiot. La -di -da. Now, how did all these weapons get into the quarantine zone? Were they improvised, or was it just all these mercenaries happened to have arsenals just waiting around? That's a good point. A how outbreak of illness. Well, I guess some of the merc mercenaries like live here and stuff, because this is a pretty big residential area. Quick save. No. Okay. Oh, yeah, but I mean, go. Let's move. It's really? It's residential area. It shouldn't be that. Heavily armed. There Except be it's enough. Omega and they're mercs. So. Well, there shouldn't be enough to host an army, especially after, you know, mo 
a lot of the non-humans, non-fortune die. Yeah. yeah. You shouldn't be able to maintain troops like this in the residential area. Without at least getting some... Uh, I've probably killed more people okay. in this area than I did in some of the some of the entire areas in Mass Effect 1. Like, there are entire yeah. quests with less enemies than this. Although Mass Effect 2 does have a couple of uh, quests without any fighting at all. Really? Show me yeah. one. Yeah. Um, Thane's loyalty mission does not have any fighting. Thane, the assassin I'm dude. I'm pretty sure you do snipe some. Um, that's more of a... Thane's? Not in Thane's. Maybe. And if it is, it's more of a story thing. It's not actual combat. Which makes a difference. That Krogan. I will definitely acknowledge that there is definitely not any cover based shooting. It's like, um. Coming. This Krogan will not die. God. Now he's dead. Oh, that's a pyro. There's just nothing interesting going on because we've just been shooting people for half an hour. There we go. He exploded. Quick save, quick save. Nope. Okay. Oh, there's, uh... This will put them down. It, it could be worse. Morton could be asking you to bring back Fortune Tales. Yep. Might as well be. Vorcha Heavy? Okay. Yeah, they're... Th How many TF2 classes have these guys got? <laughs> okay, uh, Heavy and Pyro. I think that's it. I don't know. I, I think we're gonna run into some scouts. Vorcha scouts? That'd be that'd be weird. Vorcha spy sapping my ventilation system. <laughs> he missed. Moron. And I just shot that in the middle of the air. Ow! Ow! Stop shooting me. Ow! I'm just getting shot at repeatedly. Because that's what things like to do. Unmilitarized residential area? They should have run out of ammo by now. Yeah, I have. Why haven't they? Oh, well, they're AIs. They've got infinite. Oh, yeah. Can't forget about that. I want to see a game where the AIs actually don't have infinite ammo. I want to steal a game where... I want to see a game where you can steal infinite ammo powers from the AIs. That'd be like a cheat. Let's see. No, not a cheat, just in-game. There is some reason <laughs> that they have infinite ammo, and you can steal it. Like it's an upgrade for your weapon. Infinite ammo. Or maybe there will be other repercussions, like if you shoot one, infinite ammo starts pouring out of the corpses and filling the room. <laughs> <laughs> so Jacob's been dead like this entire fight. I wish to point this out. And also that I've been doing the same fight for a long time. Yeah, Jacob may be boring, but he is at least a hard worker. Never lies down on the job. And except for when he's almost dead. I can't aim! Okay, I almost died. That would have been bad. Oh, Jacob's alive. Quick save. 